Today we are going on an adventure. I wish you one if you want. For so long, I've been trying to get you out of my head. Oh yeah, but somehow I always seem to wake up in your bed. Today, give me a May I please do a medium sweater leather latte? Hot, hot or iced? Hot, please. Hot. And then, may I do a cinnamon roll not warmed up, but then a plain bagel with cream cheese, not toasted? And this whole look, fine on your sweater leather? Um, I'm gonna go, please. I always forget to do it. So I woke up this morning. Hi, hello. Welcome to Vlogtober Day 22. No, 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 this isn't it. Vlogtober Day 23. Are you liking this outfit? Because I am in love with this outfit. <laughs> in love with the outfit. Skeptical. I obviously loved it when I was trying it on in my Shein haul, but it's a difference when you're wearing it in the comfort of your own home, you're confident in yourself as opposed to walking out with an outfit that may not be appealing to everyone else. Not that the outfit was bad, but it's just, you just never know. Um, but I still did it because I am trying to get more comfortable with, you know, just being me. And I loved it, the universe loved it, and there are other people who complimented it on my outfit, loved it so much. I apologize in advance for any binging you may hear, it's my neighbors, it is what it is. It's actually my first time talking, talking to the camera, as you see. And also talking to, like, in general. Talked a little bit at the coffee shop that I went to, bold. Talked a little bit to people in the store that I went to, but that's it. Um, but yeah, I woke up today and I didn't have a plan for today, but then something told me to go to Red Bank. I went to Red Bank because one of my, one of my, the journal that I write in that you've been seeing, the one with the elephant on it, with the leather binding, or le leather cover and binding, I got it from a store called Earth and, Earth and Spirit in Red Bank, New Jersey. And I'm on my last page of that journal and I wanted another one, but I didn't want just any other journal. I want another leather bound cover journal. So I wanted to go there and I didn't plan on going there today. Like I didn't plan it ahead of time. I just woke up and be like, you know what? 
I'm gonna go on an adventure. I wanna take a long drive. I don't wanna be in the house today. And for one minute, I judged myself. And I was like, well, this is your home. I don't wanna be in your own home. But not that I didn't want to be in my own home, it's just that I wanted to go on an adventure and do something and get out of my head because I've been in my head for the past few days. And going on the drive helped me. It was like an um, hour and 42 minutes each way, so almost four hours in general. Um, and over 70 miles each way too. So I, I, I think I did a little under 200 miles today. I was driving and I didn't even stay around the area, although beautiful, because I just really wanted to get back home show you i wanted to edit my video and i also wanted to plan more for chance at life so all that to say today was a big adventure and i allowed myself to take it i dressed in something that i really wanted to look at my heart and i felt good i felt really good and i want to show you what i got from the store which is a beautiful store and i don't i last time i went there was about three years ago to get that one one journal i'm hoping i can go there again because i hope it won't take me three years to fill up one journal and i'm hoping that i'll uh, continue to journal like i've been doing but um i haven't been there in three years and i forgot how abundant it was in things so i kind of went ape shit. i went ape shit. did not plan on spending over a hundred dollars but i did and that's fine so let me show you what i got from the store so first and foremost, I got the complete book of chakra healing. Active, activate the transfer, the transformative power of your energy centers, which is something that I have been thinking about as course for courses for Chance at Life. Is it being mind, body, and soul? What I talk about now with mind, uh, when it comes to body and soul, I think energy work is going to be a big part of that. So I'm really happy I found this energy book. In addition to this book, I found. Sacred Contracts, Awakening Your Divine Potential by Caroline Miss. Um, but I wanted to read this and it just it just something that caught my eye and it was like a indefinite yes. Um, a lot of things that I got were indefinite yeses, some of them and then whatever was a, a definite no. Were definite yeses. Anything that was a definite no I didn't get. So anything I touched and I really wanted I got. I don't know what's happening over there. It's like somebody scratching. And I don't know what it's for. And I'm trying to figure out if I should mind my business or not. Mind my business. Water bottle, that's mine. I got this money candle just because it caught my eye as well. Um, may, prosperity may prosperity flow freely through my life. And may I embrace prosperity in all forms. I sense a natural attraction. I sense a natural attraction to wealth and its comfort. I thought about just burning this when I'm working on my business because I think it's just very intentional to do it that way. That's one. This was um, one of the flags that I showed. It was talking about love and how it doesn't matter at the end of your life if you loved well, lived well, and treated people right. I think that's what it said. Probably not, but I'll show a clip here. But I'm not going to unravel it yet just yet. I'm not ready to hang it, which is going to be hanging in my room somewhere. Um, I got a few uh, stones. Um, and crystals so the first crystal that i got or sorry it's a jewel it's a crystal um anyway it's labradite and it protects and cleanses the aura stimulates the intuition and psychic centers strengthens faith in oneself and trust in the universe it's something that i need going forward when i'm going to build this empire of mine i got two different bracelets because these were two different jewels that i wanted to get or crystals that i wanted to get i just saw it in um I saw it in uh, bracelet form, so I got this. I got Amazonite, so I got, while in the store, I googled crystals that are good for um, transitioning. Crystals that are good for transitioning or in, in moments of transition, and that's what I'm in. I'm, I am in a period of transition, any kind of like strength, so I decided to google it and see which is which, or see what crystal can help, um, and Labradite was one of them. Sorry, Labradorite was one of them. And then also Amazonite, uh, relieves stress, protects against electromagnetic pollution, maintains optimum health, heals, and opens heart and throat chakras. And then last one I got, not because of what it incurred, not because it, it was good in a period of transition, I got it because it called to me. My last name is Garnett, do with that information as you will. First name Crystal, last, Gar last name Garnett, Im impeccable name. I love my name so much. Never really looked up what Garnett mean, meant, 
never <laughs> I never looked up what Garnet meant and I saw it today and I was like you know I never looked up what Garnet meant so I saw I searched for Garnet in one of the in, in the big table of uh, crystals and I found it and I read what it's for and it, encur it encourages lasting com commitment in relationships brings hope into seemingly hopeless situations opens the heart increases self-confidence I never knew my last name was bomb as shit, but I got that in a um, bracelet form. Never knew my last name meant that. Or my. It's Garnet with two T's, but. I feel like there's a cat or something scratching at a wall. I'm, I'm out of this. I'm out of my business. I don't hear any screams. I don't feel like no one's in danger. Maybe besides that animal, but I'm not sure. Um, so that's what I got for all that stuff. And then lastly, I'm gonna show you my new journal. There was a lot of them there. And all the ones that I picked up, I did not like the binding. I did not like what, uh, I did not like how it felt. But this one I picked up and I liked how it felt. But I ended up, there was one I picked up and I liked how it felt. And it had the same backing and the same cover as this one. But it was a Buddha in front and not a life tree. This one is a life tree. Isn't it freaking beautiful? Isn't it beautiful? And the pages are beautiful and it has a clasp where the other one just has like, um, it had a button and then an elastic to go around it. This is fucking beautiful. I love the way it felt in my hand and that's why I got it. And that's the end of my little haul. I am gonna actually change my dress because I wanna go outside and edit because I have not edited and posted yesterday's vlog. I'm gonna do that now. Go outside, get some more fresh air because even though I was outside, I wasn't like outside. I was in my car outside and are walking, walking to a destination. Or walking to a destination. So I'm gonna go outside, edit. Um, I'm probably gonna make a cup of coffee to take with me to be warm outside. And I'll probably just journal after maybe even read some more i'm gonna read some more for sure yeah but anyway let's go outside